Hello folks and welcome to uh, Conglomerate 451 um, in this evening's uh, multiple game stream. Or it should be a multiple game stream. Um, Conglomerate 451 is a dungeon crawler in kind of the same vein as things like Eye of the Beholder and things like that, but it's set in a cyberpunk um, future rather than, you know, a high fantasy, low fantasy situation. Um, I have played a little bit. I've played the, the, the first mission or so. But I thought for the benefit of the stream, we'll start off with a new game and see how it goes from there. You've got there already. Um, empty, one just create. So story mode, normal. This game has a plot, subplot, and a start with a start and an end. You have 75 weeks to complete your mission, then the game will end. Sounds good to me. Years 2099, city of conglomerate. Is that war? Is it? Oh well. Sector 451 has become the central battlefield. Corrupted corporations control every criminal activity. <laughs> Alliteration there. Uh, making arrangements with gangs of outlaws. As an extreme measure, the city's government has assigned special powers to private agencies, making legal the use of battle clones. Their mission? Clean up the city from crime and restore order. At any cost. That's not quite understanding of the... That's kind of the weird thing. The, the concept of um, cyberpunk is not very often understood. Because that's not cyberpunk. Corporations, big yes. You work for the government? No, that's not cyberpunk at all. Cyberpunk is against the dystopian government. Everything is ready, director. Maybe that's allowed? Maybe we go that way. Alpha team, can you hear me? I've analyzed the area, and I suggest you deploy at the edge of District 756. The lab is located in the northern area, but it'll be well defended. Watch out. Remember the mission objective. Find the virus before it's synthesized and put on the black market as a bacteriological weapon. I'll stay in touch via radio. Good luck. Okay. The afterlife technology is not entirely legal. To be able to use it, in fact, you have to use a lifeline, a currency created with human DNA used on the black market. How's the volume? That's, uh, that sounds a little bit, a wee bit loud. That looks like it's a little bit loud. I might tweak that down a smidgen. Headquarters, did you receive the images? Director, if you can hear me. Yes, select OK. OK. Good line has been established correctly. The squad is ready and waiting for your orders. I'll follow the agents closely to give them support. Cool. Enough talk, the game is on. OK, anyway, let me just quickly tweak the... Let's lower that down a bit. We can bring that up again. There you go. Yeah, so Let's go and remember the main commands. Yeah, so it's 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 you are basically it's it's a dungeon crawler, right? So you're walking with in in four directions. You can rotate. You got a map in the bottom right of the screen. Uh, so far, top left is top right is cool. Hello, we're engaging these guys. It's turn-based combat. We have our agents: the bottom requiem, edge, and mouse. <laughs> Edge is getting whacked several times. It's still a bit loud, okay. I'll, I'll tweak that out. Gangs of criminals. These suits are dangerous. Gangs of criminals often try to stop agents, but don't worry, I'll explain how to deal with them. Frankly, I remember, but go on then for your benefit. When you get close to an enemy, squad combat begins. The timeline shows an action order each character will act based on their initiative. In the top middle of the screen, you can find useful tips. Oh, combat mode is in the way, isn't it? Hmm, that is. Uh, let's see if we can shift you to left hand sides. Is there anything up here? Actually, I might put you over here on top of the, the on top of there, and I'll move you down to there. How about that? Reminds me of Legends of Grimrock. I love Legends of Grimrock. Legends of Grimrock. I have a, I've got a really old Legends of Grimrock two play, um, playlist on my channel. Oh my god, it's, 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 I love it. It's such a fantastic game. I think I hundred percented it as well. Hello, Luke. This is Cyberpunk Mind and Magic. Yeah, 
kind of. Uh, yes, select agents use skills. Right, okay. So, egg, so we are Requiem. Requiem is accurate shot. Tier 5, target enemy, damage, attack, critical hit chance, 55%. Damage is part of the damage, pierces the shield and will be redirected to HP. So I'm assuming blue is shield. I'm assuming, assuming I know. Blast targets area. Death shot does less damage, but does 70 damage versus marked. And torment targets enemy. Enemies become in contact with region, take 30% damage turn. Uh, you know what? There's two of them there. We'll go blast. How about that? And there's different ranks. You can attack back rank or front rank. Uh, what have you got there, buddy? Mouse. Neurostimulator. It removes shock and it gives him initiative. Regeneration. Prefication tech removes all debuffs. And cheap shots. Takes some damage. Slow initiative, slow attack. Basically, you're not supposed to be doing that, are you? No, so... We'll remove the uh, stunned and the debuff from you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ob shockingly enough, yes, that's, that's how that works. You're still stunned. Okay, you're stunned. Yeah, you, you were still stunned. That wouldn't actually work out, did it? Oh, weird. Yeah, that's maybe a smidgen too loud still. Uh, a bit lower there. Like, I wish I could, like, I need to equalize the, the top, the, that frequency down a bit, because it's kind of getting on me. Uh, cheap shots. Just uh, straight for the head, 70% chance to hit, 96% chance to hit the body. Uh, your head. Missed. Of course you did. Single shot. It does plenty of damage. It does extra damage against affected by radiation. Stunning shot. Target stunned. Barrier increases defense of the squad. Conflagrate. Attacks an area. Give them a huge to hit percentage. Oh. Let's hit you all then. Ooh. Deads. Oh, they're both very low in HP. Well, let's finish you off then. What's that mean? Oh, oh, oh can I get you both? I can get them both. Okay. Uh, can you finish this guy off? So skull means they're dying, possibly. Uh, they've got oh, so cheap shots. Actually, lowers their initiative. Okay, noted. Uh, stunning, uh, stunning shots. Conflagrate. It doesn't actually get you. Okay. You've got a turn coming up. I want to see what happens when it gets to your turn. So I'll just get you to shoot this guy. Into the head. Oh, deleted. What happens to you then? If we can you take a non can you take a non-action? No, I guess there's nothing there's nothing. <laughs> can I skip my turn in any way? I can look around the space, but that's about it. I guess we're shooting you. That um. was a great fight! But remember, never to underestimate your enemies. It could be fatal. What do you got here? Found a, a REM, resources module. Right. You can just call it an RM, it'd be fine. Collection of resources dropped by the enemy you defeated. Cool. Didn't see what I actually got there. There's, a, there's an auto map as well, which is thankful. Check mission objective here. Remember to check it from time to time during the mission. And the lift. Is that anything? Doesn't seem to be. It's a little thematic because I just started watching uh, Altered Carbon as well. Uh, uh, let's see how that goes. Is anyone watch for Altered Carbon? Is that any good? I just watched episode one now and I might keep watching it. Uh, is that season two you're talking about, or season three? Uh, this is the mission map. Press M to open it. Okay, I'll, I'll go. Wow. That shows me nothing. Anything here? Nope. Up the wall. 
Okay. Find the virus sample. Oh yeah, that is exactly what we're doing. It seems locked. You have to look. Let's try to hack it. Choose the agent to hack. I'm gonna guess it's gonna be you. Closed doors can be opened in various ways. Magnetic keys, activated terminal. All closed doors can be hacked. Wow. None of you are particularly good at hacking. Requiem. Uh, season 3 isn't even out there. What games? I'm going to start off with this one, Shogun, and then we'll see where I go from there. I'm not entirely sure. Remaining time. Oh, is it a game I have to play? To open the door, rotate the logic disks and match the shapes. Okay, I can kind of see that. Act quickly, each door has a timed... Um, well, we can play Deep Rock afterwards if you want. Okay, if people are up, I'll, 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 I can, I'll play Deep Rock in about 40 minutes time or something like that. Uh, right. Anyway, let's finish this off. If you will, you decide. Uh, rotate left? No. That's loud. Uh, there you go. God, that's too loud. Done. It's still really loud. Down even lower. They don't want to lower the volume too much because the, the music has been fine. The drone voice can probably come down a smidgen as well. Can we engage them first? Okay, we engaged you first. Some enemies can be hacked. Everyone nowadays has one or more cyber implants, can be breached. Use right click to access the. the, the uh... I'm guessing that wasn't supposed to happen. Uh, did I? I may have just crashed. So I think I soft locked the tutorial. Did I soft lock the tutorial? Oh no. Okay, it's combat hacking. There we go. Uh, I was thinking that I had to hold the right click. Uh, so base damage minus three. Uh, resistance to mark effect minus 60, resistance to debuff minus 50. Hack the enemy's courses to collect data. Well, let's find out then. Shields 80, HP 30. Can I just scroll down? Effects ambushed. Cool. Perfect. Hacking the enemy is a good strategy, but remember to check your agent's battery. It's a precious resource. Cool. Can you shoot at range? 62%? 67%? If I hit you, you can get too slow. You can actually... You know what? Get you in the leg. It lowers your initiative down a smidgen. And single shot. The head. Actually... There you go. Killed you immediately. Um... A bunch of stuff. Those look like hacks. Uh, shield recharge, character sheets, combat hacking, skip turn, use drugs, move squad. Ah, there's the move squad button. I was always wondering when that was when I was playing it last time. Ooh, hello. Battery up. Good. Can't open it, but it's going to take some time. In the meantime, try using the scanner to search the area to extract SPUs from that ship scans the there it is device we can loot try extracting the SPU where is the device we can loot find the virus where's the SPU did I miss something Well, the green thing on the wall? Oh yeah, could be that one, yeah. SPU's mounted in the device. Hardware, hardware 44, hardware 34. Okay, mouse, go for it. SPU's are versatile processors that you can install in your agent's equipment in order to get them bonuses and powers. Uh, press to start SPU's from the device. Extracting SPUs from the device, in the right panel you can find the stats. 
To extract an SPU, you need to cut the connectors pressing enter on the SPU's panel with the right timing, but pay attention to the device temperature. If it reaches the maximum, the device will melt and the SPU will be burned. Okay, and that's fairly simple. At least this one was. Great, you extracted the SPUs. When you will come back, you will be able to install SPUs and agent equipment. Good. Got that. Uh, you did it! Bravo! While you were having fun, I opened the door. Don't everybody thank me at once. Ooh. Uh, right, can we... Right, I guess we have to talk to you because I can't actually start combat now. Warning, my senses have detected the presence of a bomb. This music is going to end badly. Okay, can we... The bomb is active. We need to hurry. Can we give you... The seven second bomb! Oh yeah, of course it is, because this is the tutorial mission. My guys are really high, high level. They need to die. Well, let's go ahead and irradiate you. You resisted. Of course you did. Actually, we just did 326 damage and that was only a third of that bar. Oh my god, you see, a bomb. What a shame. Yeah, okay, so... Conflagrate a lot of them. That dog has missile launchers. That cyber dog has missile launchers. Um, again, let's see if you can... Yeah, you're not getting hit by the radiation at all, are you? Can we finish you off? Close enough. Can't plug the rest of them. That doggo exploded. Ow. Five seconds. Is every turn like a second? Uh, maybe, I don't know. You can blast, you can hit both of them. Accurate shot. Critical to the head. You took pretty much note, even though I'm supposed to have, I'm supposed to have penetrated... Any combat hack? This guy. Let's find out. What do we know about this person? Yeah, 5,000 health gear. We're not, you are not to be killed. We will die here. Fair enough. Okay, what can we get here? Can we get you down? Can I even see your health bar? I think. Can I can't, can I just get the angle right? I can't see that guy's health bar at all. Um. Doggo looks like Doggo's wounded. Like, uh, single shot, stunning shot. Can we stun you? Hey, you are stunned. I can kind of see your health now. I think you're still damaged though. So, torment. Actually, can I get you with the area one? No. Okay. Accurate shot. Just finish you off. There you go. Dogs and missiles are the worst. Missed. Uh, stun you again. You resisted the stun. What do you got? Special effect. Plus 10% versus marked. You're not marked though, that's a problem. That's why I'm not actually shooting you, because you're not actually marked. Are you marked? But no. Good question. Um, base damage minus 20% that you got there. Let's see how much you can actually... Your shield is down. Yeah, we're not we're not winning this. We're not supposed to win this. Let's just speed through this because I'm supposed to die here. One second. Oh yeah, yeah, where you go? One second. Is it technically possible to beat this? Uh critical chance is 40%, so. Critical for 200. Yeah. We all die. As is to be expected. Mission failed. Oh no! Edge, Requiem, and Mouse are all dead. All of them dead. Oh well. Tutorial team dead. The best tutorial team death I've ever seen.
was back from Luffy and the Fortress of Doom, way back on the SNES. Ah, you finally arrived. Have a seat, please. Where I think you technically is the last fight of Luffy two is the first fight of Luffy one in a really weird way. You failed. Every agent was killed by the bomb. Yep. But you wouldn't know that this mission was a task. It was impossible. Hey, Mikosk. It's a classic Kabayashi Maru situation. The objective is not to beat the scenario, but to put you in a no-win situation and see how you react. With apathy. And you did great. Really? So starting today, you'll be assigned to a new agency in Sector 451. Well done, Director. Thank you, Morpheus. Welcome, Director, to your new agency's headquarters. I'm Clarice, your office assistant. Nice to meet you. If you don't mind, we need to fill out a couple of documents before you take office. You are very uncanny valley, Clarice. Very uncanny valley. <laughs> Starfleet! Uh, give me a logo. I'll take quick suggestions from chat. I haven't actually set up my naming scheme yet, so I'll take some quick suggestions from chat, from logo and agency names. Uh, I do like I do like I do like this one. Uh, again, Starfleet is just interesting. You remind me of something. Deathly Hallows, maybe. Uh, that one. Anything? Anything at all? Shield for World of Horror. What is your for Twitch needed? Is that, is that the, the text based one that was mentioned before? Man, I'm running out of water already. My fajitas were quite salty. Um, Sunni Ito inspired. I mean, Junji Ito. Uh, right, anyway, let's pick something name. Uh, what's the one? I was thinking of something. <laughs> Panoptic, that works for me. Cool. to the administration department. Super uncanny and valley in your face. I'll lead you into Too the smooth. Business. Here you will meet your current agent squad. Junji Ito does creep the hell out of me though. Like Junji Ito is genuinely creeps the hell out of me. This is the cloning agency and I'm Elise Delacroix, chief of staff. See, also different kind of uncanny valley there because she's meant to be a human. Uh, the center of the, the center, most advanced technology in the cloning field. However, it would be great to expand our mutation database. You should learn more about the region. And yes, blah, blah, blah. Anyways, have to get that brass tax. I'll have you create your first squad. Select clone new agent for the left menu. Please note every will always be slightly different from all the others. Even if you select the same background, the cloning technology is never 100% accurate in reproducing the original subject. Let's pick, let's start with making new agents, shall we? Yeah, Junji Ito did This Is My Hole, which freaks me out in massive ways. Right, so we got a soldier, an infiltrator, and a drifter. Um, you can't make those yet, you have to need to uh, unlock them. So we'll make one of each. A soldier, mid-range combat, has advanced tactical skills and provides support to his allies. His equipment lets him a large absorb lots of amounts of damage, limited range, great flexibility. Okay, we'll start off with you. Memory blocks. Your skills are. Can I? Um, I'm just selecting skills here. Am I, am I selecting skills? Single shot. Okay, I'm just selecting skills. Single shot. Uh, stunning shot. Um, first aid for healing. Target self. Okay. Shield regeneration targets a squad member. Barrier targets the squad. Conflict rate is an area. A shot. And get shield regeneration for healing purpose. Outburst. Outburst is 
Damage versus androids. Don't really see the point of view. We'll go for shield regen because that's a little bit healy. Mutations. Normal DNA. You can get all the DNA we get in here as well. I wonder what some of these are. Vampirism there. Oxodoma. Vampirism? Some kind of animal teeth. Uh, some kind of eyes. Weird. Yeah, normal DNA, that'll do me. Confirm cloning. Create clone. Can I not rename you? Apparently not. <laughs> it's a 3D printed human. Aha, convenient bar. Okay, we can name you. Okay. Uh... uh... First person to say after this message. The first person I see will be the will be the name of this. First person to type something. Anything. It's the Dorgo it is. <laughs> uh, Sorgo's chat is lovely that color, so we'll go there. Uh second agent, okay. Second agent will be an infiltrator. Uh now, what do we have here? Accurate aim increases your vision, critical hit chance, and base damage. Spark removes stun, removes mark, and gives you increased vision. Um, the accurate shot blast is the area skill. Death shot is extra damage versus marked, and you can mark as well. More chance to swing critical hit. Torment is. Now, I know for a fact that the support guy can do death mark as well, so I'm not going to go for death mark. I'll go for accurate shot, blast, death shot, and, um, actually, no, you, need, you require radiation, don't you? Let's back a bit. Um, see, that's useful because of, of the piercing. Um, we got an AoE in Conflagrate before. I'll get the death shot. I'll get Torment because something's key off radiation and I'll pick accurate uh accurate aim. Uh Park removes stun, which can be useful, I suppose. Uh normal DNA. And first name, first person in chat after this. That's not Sdorgo. <laughs> ah! TOS! TOS! Human McHuman. Human McHuman it is. Although technically it should be McCosk, because I did say first person who speaks, not what the suggestion was. Um <laughs> it could be really harsh and just do that. Okay, I can't match colours anymore, because fine, I'll go human McHuman. Uh get some different colour. That's purple for you. One more agent and the drifter. Because yeah, you do death mark as well. So electrocute, hits enemies that are shocked, take 30% of damage per turn, death mark, swift strike, see enemies that could by radiation take additional damage. So I'll go for swift strike for attack number one. Improved weapon, increases damage, battlefield medicine removes radiation and heals, neurostimulator removes shock and gives initiative. Uh, okay, we're gonna go with uh, swift strike. Death mark because you need that as well. An improved weapon, pulse. This does a little bit of damage, but increases damage versus cyborgs. Is that all that does? You do no damage at all, but you take some lot of damage. Enemies are shocked, one hundred percent of the time. Interesting. Uh, pulse. We'll increase damage and. Take DPS. Uh, take a heal as well. Go on. And right. Next name goes now. I will put up my uh, list of Homie the Drifter. Thank you, Boscro. Perfectly named. Oh. 
Hugo Boss did turn up first. That is true. That is true. Home Hugo Boss did turn up first. My bad. Yep, that's true. My bad. Uh, back to the main office. Okay, cool. Now, if I can get the, if I just quickly click through all of these, you get the, the, that's there. Research center. Uh, let's just research new things. Yeah, I know. Basically, you get to research. You get you get to spend tech on research essentially. Cloning tech increases. Come on. Oh please. It's research. It's a tech tree. You know how these work. Basically, you spell you spend money in tech to get in this branch. You get the uh, mutations. What was the one we saw? Loxo. Was it Loxo? Something or other. Loxodoma. Resistance to the onset of disorder plus ten. That sounds less impressive. Right. Uh, healing research. Regeneration technology. Detox tanks. Uh, training research. Upgrades to, lets you upgrade attack skills. Lets you upgrade defense skills. Military research. Allows you to upgrade weapons. Allows you to upgrade shields. Uh, cyber research. Gives you more augmentations, I think. Yeah. Um, health centers where you is where your wounded agents heal. Uh, cyber graveyard is where you, is basically your memorial area. The director's office is just my office, and it basically shows our proficiencies. I think agency perks, yeah, which we can improve by getting more reputation. I think uh, the archive is just things we've seen before. Come on. Uh, and quarters are just our current people. We have Hugo Boss with some kind of pistol. Oh, for God's sake, yes. Tribute pistol. Shieldcast Jin and the cyber, Cypher model hair. Um, we have Human McHuman, the infiltrator. And Sdorgo, the soldier with a massive Gatling gun. What's that? That is a boomer. <laughs> okay, boomer. And what's that? What are you called? The Justifier. Okay, I think we're gonna go straight to the next mission, I think, just because we should. Ah, you must be the new director. I'm Caleb Ice Wenham, the operator, and she's Ego. I'll be your voice and your will during missions. Just give me the orders and I'll pass them along to the agents in the field. Ego, on the other hand, will be your eyes. She'll always be with the squad, recording and broadcasting events to you in real time. Cool. Sector 451 of Conglomerate City is under influence of four corporations. Your job is to free the sector by completing missions. This is the, the Hive is a collection of apartments, corridors, walkways in the midst of semi-abandoned buildings. Once a residential area, the Hive is now mainly inhabited by gangs of criminals and pariahs. You cannot even pay a decent dwelling with a few credits they earn. This is the first area where they can operate. Okay, we'll go, go to... Mission? Start a new mission. Okay. Conglomerate City is a dangerous place. Good luck, Director. Okay, so our team is here. We have find the target items. Recovering the hidden objects in this location will weaken the corporation. Corporation is attacked. Something. Reputation credits attack research. Okay, well, let's go straight in then. That robot is that robot is extremely creepy. You go saw me hold the gun. This is the three year syndicate? No, it's 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 a cyberpunk version of Legend of Grimrock, I think you could possibly call it. Cyborg human. Okay. Yeah, that's my car. Cool. Uh right, so we just finding the elevator. Scan area? Anything? Nay. It's a trap. Right, okay, so what do we got here? You got you do Swift Strike, which is automatically piercing. Hang on. Uh, you can move the squad. Shield recharge. Alright, who's got the best hacking ability, actually? Good question. Uh, okay. Cypher deck plugins. You only got offense, so... Let's find out what we know about you. 70. Okay. Uh, can you hack you as well? Okay, we know about you. Right, okay. Uh, torment. Torment. 
I'm tormenting you. Affected by radiation. Blast it all. Um, that's not a conflagrate. Let's see. You go, boss. Remove the radiation status. Haha. That's convenient. Heal. Uh, right. What can you do? Accurate shot. Head shot. Torment. Uh, that pierces, right? If that pierces, let's start. See if you can work on getting. It did a little bit of damage through shields, not that much. Uh, conflagrates. Stunning shot. Okay, you're down. Um, death mark you. Okay, you're marked, which means now death shot should do way more damage against you. Provided you hit. You got radiation as well? Well, let's do that. And you're still marked, so come on, death shot. You've got an 80% chance to hit. Come on. It's twice now. Stun you then. Okay, you're stunned for a turn. Still marked? Uh, that lasts for three turns. We can refresh that or we can just hit you with stress strike. Okay. Still marked, okay. Hit the guy, please. Thank you. A great scout. Uh, right, anything here? We can scan around. Wiz, red sharks, hound, distance. Look, what are my ranges then? Hang on. Uh, character sheets. What are my ranges? Uh, 13 meters, 13 meters, 13 meters, okay. That's roughly my range at the moment, so 25 meters is up ahead. Okay, so they're 40 meters, they are 40 meters there, they are 40 meters exactly. If I take a step forward, they're you're engaged now. We can click so we can start the fight. They're out of range, but we can move the squad a step forward. Out. Now we're marked. Okay. Let's mark you as well, cyborg. Alright, death shot to the body. And stun you as well. Stunned. Okay, we can skip your turn. We set initiatives. You're marked anyway. Affected by radiation. By radiation? Okay, that's not what I was expecting. I thought you took shock damage. Missed. Uh, stunning shot. You do more damage against people affected by radiation. Cool. Uh, special effects by radiation. Let's not have that happen, shall we? What's it debuff? That debuff is resistance to the onset of trauma minus 10. You're still marked, right? Yeah, you are. 60% chance to hit the head. I don't trust it. That'll do me. Right. You're marked as well, but none of you have gotten through shields yet, so we're good. A single shot to the head. Well, they're both deep. Okay, they're both DBNO, but what actually happens at this point? I generally don't know what actually happens at this point. What happens if it gets to their turn? Uh, heal up yourself, give yourself some shields. Right, now it's your turn. Dying. Dead. Okay, that's weird. You get a chance to get back up again, possibly? Okay, this, is there a path over here? There's a path over here. Ooh, there's something over here. What's over here? Oh, a shop. 
Okay. Welcome to the bargain shop. The best SPUs, which I have no reputation for. Alright. Cool. Fair enough. Have it your way. Crazy boss name wannabe. This is a city terminal. You can use it to buy services from hackers to get a tactical advantage for your mission. Basic systems. Download map. Download security data. Unlock all the doors. Proximity sensor jammer. Advanced systems. Overload REMs. Overload facility. Extra rank. Extra rep. Okay. Well, I think we're okay with that. Thanks. Uh, nothing over here? No. Okay, let's get back out. Ooh, can I go back up here, actually? No. This is me and my paranoia, too. I don't want to sound pedantic, but with such damaged shields, you risk coming to a bad end. Perhaps you could use the battery to recharge them. Quiet, you. You can't do this now, can you? Uh, shield recharge... Yeah, you can't. You got the combat skill, but I don't think you can do the outside combat, which I always thought was weird. Like you've got a shield that recharges shields by fifty percent on anyone, but you can only do it outside combat. What the hell? Uh, okay, items for sale: emblem, pro one v one, plug-in hacking bonus. Hang on. Uh, resist the stun effect. Resist the debuff effects. Resistance to shock effect minus fifty. Oh, I guess they stay alive so you can hack them. Is that what that is? Okay. I don't understand. What are you supposed to do? I do not understand that. Okay, that one's fine. I don't understand what this is. Offense. I guess... It, yeah, I guess it. you put it on an attempt. I don't know how that works. We'll figure it out afterwards. Right. Ooh, something up here. What's this? Oh, this is the elevator, okay. We found the elevator. In the far future, there is no diagonal movement. Nope. Diagonal movement is a thing of the past. Find the weapon blueprint. Okay, now we're actually in the mission area. Oh, is that an overworld then? The hive is a collection of apartments, blah, 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 blah. Zone system activated, nothing. Okay, we are actually kind of... Are we meant to be, like, high up at the moment? I can't tell. Can't quite see down. Mutt whispers, mutt whispers. We can engage you from here, can't we? Yes, we can. Okay, let's engage you from here. All right. Get some combat hacking done. What are you? Beholder. Let's just find out what you are. Okay, your HP is 36. Uh, massively just the stun and radiation. Okay. Not sure what quite vision is. Is vision accuracy? I don't know. Human McHuman. No point radiating you. I shot into you. Okay, you can straight up delete you. And you're moving up because you're melee. Oh, cool. That works for me. Um... Ow. Affected by drain. Plus 5% pain level per turn. Uh... You pierce, so... That said, you can mark you. Can guarantee that? Can we? Well, we can let's mark you then. Let's mark your buddy over here. You're affected by drain, and you're also stunned. Kind of want to remove that stun from you, but honestly, let's do that. There we go. I'm not sure what drain actually does, but hey, you can't. It's, it's very rare to. Does it actually make that into account? No, it does not actually take their stun resistance into account on the text here. So if I didn't know that, uh, hit percent, hundred percent. Okay, you're marked, right? So let's go for you. Affected by poison, affected by drain. 
Wow, everyone's getting damaged by everything right now. Um, so strike you. Oh, straight up just killed also. And uh, death shot to the face. There you go. 93 HP damage. What do you got here? Uh, generation 2, 16 kilobyte something or other. What are you? Tiger version 1.8. Generation 4, 64 kilobyte. No idea. Not a clue. Haven't quite figured that one out yet. Ooh, more doggos. Uh, how far away? They're 10 meters away. Okay. It's a trap. But I'm attacking. Why is this a trap? I'm the one attacking. Um, let's increase the base damage of you. Um, accurate shot on just any one of them. You just didn't do much damage this time around for some reason. Not entirely sure why, but you just didn't. Uh, conflagrate on everyone. We've got damage here, a little bit of damage there. Swift strike you. Yeah, see, now you're, now you're only piercing. Let's see, double radiation, yeah? Okay, fine. Why are you only doing a little bit of damage now? Alright, you're dead. Poison and radiation and debuffs and good lord, you've been hit by everything under the sun. Let's remove that radiation from you at least. Um, minus ten. Why have you like those those ultra kills that were happening before? There we go. That's something. I think the real point of this is that we can hack now if we need to. And there's nothing I can do other than the holder, and I don't need to do that, really. Uh, just kill. Ooh, there's something here. What's this? No battery. Probably didn't need that. Not without first wasting stuff. Ooh, hello. What do we have here? I wonder if that's the extension of the, uh... Oh, it's something here. Money. Cool. Anything over here? Nope. Okay, we're, we're out. Thankfully, seems to be things, something... Yeah, certain things seem to turn up on the... I feel a disturbance in the force. I mean, my senses are detecting something important in this room. Ego, I hate you already. Uh, there's something over there, clearly. Open blueprint. Okay, we found what we wanted. We want to complete. We want to go back to the agency. Frankly, let's just keep exploring, because otherwise, what's the bloody point? I want to see a little bit more. Okay, let's keep going. And how small? How small is this level? Because we haven't even explored over there. Did I just get lucky? Is there like no space down here? Maybe. Maybe just got lucky and got the exact right door. See, lucky. It's like the, it's the first door to the left, and good adventures always go left, so. Over here. Another door. Loads of doors. This place is massive. They just luck out massively. Another chest over there. I guess we're going to Luton. Some tech. Anything in here to pick up? I got this horrible feeling that that's the thing they've told me about. Oh, this you can you can scan the tech for this. Like I'm never gonna find what I, what it's supposed to do. <gasps> we did find something. Ha! Ah, so SDU hardware. Let's do the highest hardware. You do. You go. Right. Let's do this thing. Start. And bam. Generation 1, 8 kilobyte, 
increases max shield, survival instinct. If you put it in the head, increases radiation, resistance to radiation initiative. Okay, cool. That's something, I guess. It's a piece of copper and a few threads. But maybe we'll is that a thing? That is a thing. More. This is an echo interface system. By hacking it, you can extract the memory data. Who's going to hack? 15? Yeah, it is. You are the hacker. Extract memory. Oh yeah, the hacking game in this. Here in the lower right panel, there is a list of codes you will need to find to gain access to the system. Here in... So in the lower left panel, there's a system code log. Identify the correct... Basically, I need to match imp... IMAP asset operation 223 file over here. And then click on them. It's the mini... It's the... It's the... It's the, it's the, uh, it's the hacking mini game they've got here. Okay, let's find out. We want IMAP asset 223. Come on, there you go. Uh, one three, uh, one five three seven, and uh, SAS. Ah, just missed it. Flynn. Warning level six to one. Come on, give me. What I need every data extracted from the echo. When I was just created, it's a little different from like. Black and white display. I've hacked more complex systems than that. What does it remind me of? Is Uplink sim was Uplink similar? Is it was it Uplink I'm thinking of? It might be Uplink I'm thinking of. Ooh. Plenty of everything. And a bit of lifeline as well. Okay. Ooh. Another SVU. SPU. Alright, let's keep going. Got you. Cool. Looks it's not very valuable, but it could be useful. Yeah. We in? Cool. Scan everything. Oh, didn't look like it. Are SPUs just like mods for gear or something? Yeah, no. No, what's the no, we came in through here. Alright, back this way. Go over this way then. Oh my god, there's so much. There's actually a lot of places for me to look around for stuff. Jesus. For Jim. You know what else I watched recently? I, re I actually I watched uh, Creed recently. Oh, Creed Two. Sorry, I watched Creed ages ago. I watched Creed Two recently. Uh, I think. The original Creed was better, but still, I enjoyed it. Uh, okay, what's over here? Anything major? Nope. I think the scan is just to show you um, where where these SPUs are found. It just shows you where these SPUs are located. It doesn't show you chests and stuff. As far as I know, anyway. Okay, the going? Have we get have we gotten everything? There's technically a bit of space over there, maybe. Yeah, is there? Yeah, there's some area over there that might be is that actually the edge of the map? I can't tell. That might just be in the edge. Yeah, this yeah, this is the edge of the gym where there isn't anything. I don't think I've been this far, because there wasn't really a need to be. Okay, is there something in there? Nope. Okay. And over here. This is kind of this is weird because like it blocks out places you can't walk, which means that in my head this is a massive room, but on the map this doesn't look like a massive room. This looks like a like a weird room with a couple of corridors, even though this is just a massive room. I kind of wish the game would make a difference, differentiate either between areas where you can't walk and areas that are part of the same room. Okay, we still need to go up there. This place is actually a lot bigger than the mission wants you to be. Anything in the middle corridor here? No, I think we're so far we're so good. All right. Ah, okay. Quick scan here. Aha! The one over there. Looks like the only thing. Does that thing turn up on the? Uh... See, this thing doesn't turn up on the, uh... on the on the map. Just because I scanned, it, it turns up. Ooh, plenty of SPUs in the device. Ooh. Ooh, er, misses. All right. Okay. Let's focus on you, please, because you look more expensive. Ah, 
Oh, we can do all of them, okay. Alright. Cool. Done, and... Ego, shush. Like, I'd rather have Navi at this point. Okay, are we good? We got everything we can go. Yeah, let's go back to the agency then. Corporations have lost influence. Minus 10% influence already? Wow, that was... Survived, survived, survived. Mission rewards, extra stuff in the missions. Flexible items, Echo 20, SVUs found loads of them. That's actually annoying. Because <laughs> I can't tell what they are. Plugins found, and SNs found, and Christ knows what all those mean. Hopefully we can find out for reals. Rank progress. Rank progress. Becomes proficient in torment, and this skill is now mastered. Drink I Cool. Why did only you become proficient in something? Pain plus five, pain plus five, intoxication, fifteen. Yeah, you know, because you got poisoned and stuff. Okay, fine, whatever. I need to fill up my water as well. Uh, mission exploration complete with success. Agency earns money, tech, and reputation. Caldera Technology Unlimited has lost influence over the city. It's a pleasure to meet you, Director. Let me introduce myself. I am known as the Diplomat. I'm an agent of the government, sent to Conglomerate City to monitor and assist you. Again, that's not the point of Cyberpunk. I will ask you from time to time to take care of certain nuisances. I'm sure you'll be good of help. Uh, thank you for your time, Director. Have a nice day. Ah, yeah, loud. Okay, well, back to that then. Okay, so we have some tech and some li lifeline and reputation uh, research. So, military tech. We can... Upgrade some weapons? Can we research this? No. I need to research you, don't I? Higher specialized staff will be able to fuel in future research. So basically, this starts off the trees. Okay. Hey, do I need to do the first... The first... Yeah, I need to do the first one. Okay, let's, let's, let's prime the research trees, shall we? I was wondering why. Because like, I played the tutorial for this ages ago. And I'd forgotten most of it, which is most kind of why I read it now, because I forgot about left shift. I've forgotten about combat hacking entirely. And now I've forgotten about the fact that I need to basically start tech off, because you don't even start with the research lab. Oh, these are... Okay, research does, does take a while, and fair enough. Let me research some of this stuff. Locked. Need a reputation of 10 to unlock this. So I can... The only thing I can research here are these three things. It'll take a, re a week to research. So we can research shock resistance. We can research base damage plus 10. Why would I not take that? Because obviously increased damage. This is good. I'm hired by the government because corporate, corporations are too powerful. Um, I'm basically run by the... I'm basically a government agency, which is totally counter to what Cyberpunk is all about. <laughs> Um, at least I'm an agency hired out by the government. No one's healing? Regeneration tanks? No one needs to be in here. Detox tanks? I haven't got any. Okay, so, so I can reduce their pain intoxication, but I, frankly I'd just rather not. I'll do one more mission and then we'll maybe might switch games, possibly. Maybe this is ANCAP Punk. What is ANCAP Punk? Is that a thing, or I'm supposed to know about? Because I don't. Right, can you do anything about your weapons and stuff? Okay, right. Upgrade locked. I cannot do cyber research available. Military research available. So what actually goes in here? The SNs go in here. Right. Or well, the SPUs go in here. Cool. I can't be installed here. What? Oh, I can actually install it there. Oh. Wow, just... Are they, oh, they're one-offs. Okay, right. That was probably at my bed. Uh, drag and drop plug-in. Tiger. Oh, okay, right. I understand. This reduces initiative. This one 
reduces resistances. Those ones give resistance to your friends, maybe. Okay, so you're the best hacker, so we're gonna give you we'll give you tiger. Memory cost, battery cost. Right, I understand. I now understand how this works. Okay, and, and, and shield cast, Jin. What's survival instinct? Not a clue what that is. Uh, shield, head, leg. No implant installed. Okay, you've got no cyber, so I can't give you SPUs there. I see, I understand. Training our agents means improving their skills and powers. Do this, you can spend credits, tech, and lifeline. We can't upgrade your skills because training research isn't available yet. And special ability, not really, but just normal DNA. And uh, cool. Well, what can we put on your weapon here? Uh, critical hit chance plus 10, base damage plus 2, base damage plus 5, base damage plus 2. You know, critical hit chance. You can, you can have that. Yoink. Um, shield class ghost. Okay, we'll put you in there. Why not? Shield. Shield. Okay, this is a weapon one. This is a body one. Okay, this can't go anywhere other than in stuff. And that can go in the weapon as well. Okay, so we put you under the weapon. You want to look at this? No. Okay, and you... See, what is your hackable stats? Do we have quick... Can you check, quickly check the hack stats here? Hacking, 16%. 14%, 29 Yeah, so you're the best hacker we've got. Okay, I'll go back to you. Uh, give you base damage plus 5. Okay. Base damage plus 2, plus 2. Both give you vision. What is vision? No idea. Uh, give you your titan class shield. Sure, why not? And both you're both crap at hacking anyway, so don't even bother. Customize? Okay, I can, I, can, I can actually change the names on the fly. Rank. Very XCOM, you can get all the way to Colonel. Uh, inspect agent. What is vision? The precision, it's accuracy. Just call it accuracy, come on. Uh, anything else I'm needing? Survival instinct is probability of survival if mortally wounded. Ah, okay. Age one week. <laughs> Less clones. Okay. Right, next mission, I think, because I don't think I've got much else to be done here. My reputation is not big enough to do anything. Uh, so we have uh, Omega Nick Services Unlimited, Caldera Technology Unlimited, founded 2081, Racket is Prostitution, Boss Unknown. Yeah, new mission. Operators attacked Caldera Unlimited. Hmm. Okay, we've done that one, right? Yeah, let's go to this one then. Find and kill the target. Can we just keep doing the same mission over and over again? Let's change mission then. Let's find and kill that target. This area is controlled by an armed crew. Free the area by killing their leader. I Start from one end of the city district to gather resources before the mission goes, or we can go straight to the mission area. Frankly, we're going to go straight to the mission area. We'll go straight to the mission area. I'll finish the mission, then I'll swap over to uh, Deep Rock. Anyway. Right, we're still... Is this the same map again? Please tell me this isn't the same map. Please tell me it's like randomly generated. I think it might be, but I remember this room being like this before. Uh, okay, let's do this way. Okay, this... Was this the gym before? I can't remember. Uh, open that up. What do we have here? Loads of stuff. Okay, echo stuff. All right, let's hack for a bit. Okay. Yeah, we've done this one. Thank you. Go away. I need. To, I see it now. There. Okay. Good. Hosts. HR eight zero seven. And tell I till. Telk I till three sixty. Go. Grab that real quick. When I was just created. Back when I still had a life in life, I hacked more complex systems than that. Only for techie. Ooh, highly advanced SN, but only a techie can use it, which I haven't actually got yet. Right. Let's start off. 
This agent does not have sufficient knowledge to extract the SPU. Fine. Whoop, missed. Um, bam. Burned, apparently. It's not very valuable, but it could be useful. Okay. This place is a real wasteland. Same loadout as before. Is there, if there's a gym. Okay, this, this room didn't exist before. It is slightly randomized. It just happened the outside looked exactly the same. Um, what did we just see? We just spotted, there we go. Uh, start. Oh. Right. It's a piece of copper and a few threads. But maybe we'll find some useful. Ego, shush, Christ. Yeah, okay, this definitely is, wasn't here before. It just so happens that this like, this area is looks exactly the same. Maybe it's this, it's probably made of it's probably tile based, so tile based? Is that the word I'm looking for here? Owl, red sharks. Engage them. Straight in. Uh, right. You can mark them immediately. So go, yeah, go ahead. Mark the, the hound guy, because I'm kind of more concerned about him than anyone else. Human, mark human. Five have damage there. Can you conflagrate the whole thing? Yes, you can. Conflagrate a bunch of them. This mainly just spread the damage around. Uh, you can swift strike. Uh, increase base damage. Increase base damage of human with human. Yeah, I'll, I'll be hopping off afterwards. After this one as well. You think you could wait like as long as it takes you to finish this mission. Uh, ooh, a swipe. Okay. Uh, right, I'm on death marking you. Sure, why not? Take you straight up. Uh, can you just straight up kill this guy? Wrong weapon, but it works. <laughs> you died. Um, conflagrate both of them, because it'll help you as well. Ooh, you dropped a orange. Orange tends to mean good things. Sen. Just a lot of money. Oh, okay, we do get some good stuff over there. Anything over here? No. That wasn't the target. Something seems to have activated. Okay. Right. Quick. Nothing? Okay, nothing. Good. Grab that. Go around the other corner here. Okay. Mark, uh, who do you have here? Slugger, Thug. Yeah, sure, why not? Pick one. Still marked. You resisted something, but you're still marked. Uh, it's gonna conflagrate a lot of them? Yeah. Well, pretty cool to somebody. Nice. Ooh, that guy's almost dead immediately. In which case, let's finish the job on you, shall we? Oop, I missed the target. Hey! Nope, it's fine by me. Headshot. They're both down on the ground. Finish them off. And that was the last one. Can we go now? We have a mission to complete in case you've forgotten. Oh my god, Ego, I'm gonna... 
Two battery. Yeah, you need the battery up. Be careful. He's a very strong opponent. Is he? Is he? Is he really? Engaged. Seems like everyone has it out for us. Maybe wearing these corrupted suits is attracting a little too much attention. Tell that to Luke. Uh, okay. Straight for the body. Straight for the body, go on. Was <laughs> most of your health down. Uh, buddy? It's your turn. What are you doing? One point of HP damage. How dare you, sir? How very dare you? Stun you. And you're stunned. Okay, that's what you do now. Your life now is currently stunning everything. Uh, I think you took a little bit of HP damage. Let's, uh, not, let's not deal with that, shall we? Um, you're marked again. Can you go for the head this time? 61% chance to hit. I'd rather go for the 86, to be honest. And can we stun you again? Stunned again. Oh, and critical as well. Can we hack you in any way? Do you get anything out of this? Uh, that lowers initiative, but we can just hit you here and see what this does. You got, you got no HP, no health. Yeah, let's, let's get this stats. Dying, marked. You had a 61% stun resistance. I was kind of lucky to stun you twice then, I guess. Uh, finish you off. There you go. Mission complete. Keep exploring for the time being. Just because I got this to pick up. And I can probably clear this room out of stuff as well. Whoa, hello. Cool. Uh, anything else here? No, I think we're good. I want to clear. Let's clear the map out as best we can. Then, if anything, for the experiences we're gonna get, because uh, we think we cleared out this area here, we cleared out that area there. All that's left is whatever is down here. All that's left is whatever's down there, which hopefully shouldn't be too much. Down here. Because yeah, this, this has to double back this way, so it's not going to be too much. I could have told a lie right now, but no, no. Actually, yeah, this is done. See, so it's only down here, though. Single door here. Please don't, like, do a massive stretch. Oh, hello. Oracle Whispers. Same kind of dude we had before, but with something over there to grab. Okay, we'll just we'll start the fight ourselves because it's just the kind of people we are. Immediately mark you. Uh, took the minus defense as well. Ooh, beautiful. Uh, death shot straight to your body. <laughs> Deleted. Okay, you definitely didn't have boss health then. Uh, can you conflagrate you? You could just conflagrate the terror. You see what that, that does? A little bit of damage to everybody. Radiation and poison. Okay, let's remove the radiation then, at least. Radiation and poison, again. You're down. Thankfully, just... There you go. You're both down. You're a little bit healed up. And... Honestly, just... Do what we can. That's not going to do much to you at all. It'll increase your accuracy for a bit. Conflagrate, get both of them. There we go. Combat over. Uh, oh, where's my mask gone? There. Uh, hang on. Okay. Do what we can here. Oh, this is going to be tricky. Okay, let's see how this works out. Uh. Not too bad this was. Bam. Okay. Critical hit chance plus 20. That's... Wow, really? That's... Circuits like that aren't easy to extract. I'm almost amazed by your skill. Almost. I can mute the drone, right? I can mute the drone, right? <laughs> I think I can mute the drone. Anyway, I think that's pretty much the map cleared. 
end of mission, return to the agency. Minus 10% interest to you guys. Plus 10%, plus whatever that is. Three survives. I've got 10 reputation now, which is nice, I guess. Got a bunch of stuff. Got nice ascends. Not sure where green lies in the rarity area. Uh, continue. Rank progress, you've ranked up. You've ranked up as well. We can see what ranking up as well before we stop. It took a little bit of pain. What's with the Tsun Syndrome? <laughs> Good question. We earned money. Watanabe Maigina specialized data has lost influence over the city. Good news from the research center. New mutation research has been completed. The effect on your clones increased peripheral vision. Both all the ring all the have increased in rank. Okay. And you're back again. I'm guessing it's white, green, blue, purple, orange, yeah. Good morning, director. I have a rather sensitive ring for you. A freelance fixer has asked us to hack into the Gunina Nanotech network and deploy a virus. Please pay attention, you have a limited amount of time to complete this mission. Have a nice day. A mission assigned to you is now available from the map, marked with this icon. Okay, so we have a specific number. We can get specific missions. Cloning center. Backgrounds has been increased, so not that I'm going to do this. What is a splicer? A splicer is basically a healer. Heal wounds and relieve pain, reducing the chance of physical injury. Her offensive capabilities are very limited. Okay, so you got a healer here. So you got what, a buffer, a high damage, long range, physically weak, and good defense guy. Okay, cool. Uh, I understand. Good to see that. Uh, quarters. Okay, so let's 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 tech this promote you people. So Hugo. So striker archetype. Striker is an agent specialized in improving themselves by hitting enemies. Every critical hit gives you a 100% chance to increase increase the base damage. Brawler, suffering damage has a 20% chance to activate the effect. Resistance to the onset of disorder. That feels like a mistranslation. That is such a clumsy. Resistance to the onset of disorder feels like something was run over translation, and that's what they came up with, and it doesn't feel neat. Um, that feels like. Like resistance to all status effects. Onset of disordered feels odd. And if batteries hide than 70%, the damage suffered is reduced by 50%. That's kind of crap for you because you use your battery a lot. You use your battery quite a bit. His head looks photoshopped onto his body. I guess technically, or, technically they all are. <laughs> what are you? How are you holding that gun, Hugo? Really? See, while I kind of like this, you're da you don't tend to do that much, do you? Like, you use your battery more than anyone else, Hugo, so... I guess we'll put this on? No, it's... it's... <sighs> this makes the most sense, but also the least sense, because you do use most of your battery. You don't critical hit often enough, and I don't want you to get hit, so... Alright, I'll do that anyway, because... You're not using that battery anyway. Right, next. You. Vanguard type. Capable of helping the allies by hitting enemies. A critical hit gives a 100% chance to activate for one of the other squad members increases their accuracy. That's useful, because you critical hit more often than most. Defender. Suffering damage gives other squads attack plus 15. And tactician. Gives an additional critical hit chance against enemies with full HP. So against your first shot gets an additional 25% chance to crit. And HP I think is calculated separate to shield points. So I like that. Okay. And who's next? It's you, Dorgo. Striker. A critical hit chance gives you more defense. If you take damage, the other squad speeds up. Or tactician. Enemies are hit are stunned if their HP is lower than 25. Enemies hit are stunned if their HP is lower than 25. Interesting? But you have a stun attack already. Uh you know what? Do that. Just because sometimes you'll get the uh, of crits. Anyway, uh, cloning centers, we can clone. 
If you clean, let's clone someone new, right? Let's just clone someone new for the for the hell of it. Splicer. Um. Okay. Oop, oop, hang on, back a bit, back up. Smoke screen. Uh, attacks in an area for no damage but reduces enemy accuracy. Charge bolts. Targets hit are disabled by EMP. Cheap shots. Oh yeah, we had one of you in the beginning, didn't you? Because that hit lowers the initiative of attackers. But you don't do much damage at all. Everything you have has way reduced damage. Um, your is attack your accuracy then? Your standard accuracy? I don't know. That can never crit. Um, smoke screen might be useful. A neuro stimulator increases, removes shock, and adds regeneration. This is a super heal. Painkiller removes drain, recovers pain. Purification tech removes all debuffs to the squad. Okay. Uh, re re recovers pain, whatever that is. Hit the regen and take charge bolts as well for the disable. That gives you... Oh, that increases the cost of the drug. Okay, so that's what the flip side is. It increases the cost of the clone. Uh, we'll create the clone. Can you name you here, or do you have to name you after name you afterwards? Right. TOS, TOS, look away now! Look away now! Ah! Like, they didn't they did not think about this at all. Uh Give me a name. I'm going to stop after this mission anyway, but give me a name just for in case we carry on into the future. Xerox Fade it is. Uh, with a Z face. Uh, G. Blue. Why not? Okay. Anyway. I'm going to call uh, this game here. I'm going to probably switch to um, Deep Rock Galactic, but. Uh, let me just hop off. I enjoyed it. If you want me to carry on this on off stream, uh, let me know in either now or in the comments of the video when it goes up on YouTube tomorrow. And uh, I will see you for the next time. Say bye to YouTube. Bye, YouTube.